Hey guys, it is Monday night at 5.15 p.m. my time in California. Uh, Bitcoin's at 97,700 after having uh, fallen as low as 94,000 uh, after Microsoft uh, MicroStrategy finished their $2 billion uh, at the money stock offering and went and bought $2 billion worth of Bitcoin. Um, and uh, this episode is going to be about the most amazing Bitcoin yield appreciation over the last 30 days. So I'm, I'm not sure how I'm going to say that exactly in the title, but think 30% in 30 days. Let me, let me just put it that way. This is an amazing, amazing number. And before I dive into it and go through all the details of it, I, I just want to remind you guys, to follow me on YouTube. A lot of you guys follow me on X. I appreciate it. I love X. It's great. Uh, but I'm also trying to get my YouTube numbers up. And, uh, you know, for a very long time, I was just, you know, I, I, I passed 100,000 on X. Uh, probably the fastest growing Bitcoin account on X. Um, and I want to do the same for YouTube. A lot of people don't, or they're not on X, they are on YouTube. A lot of people like to look for my content on YouTube. So I'm up to about 24,000 viewers on YouTube. I really would love to get to 25, 30,000 viewers on subs on YouTube. It would mean a lot to me. Okay, enough begging. Let's go back into the analysis. Um, I posted, uh, you know, there's been a lot of talk about is, is uh, MicroStrategy's valuation at two and a half times, um, you know, uh, Bitcoin value, justified or not. And I did an amazing calculation. I'm going to show you this calculation. Uh, and I think it'll, it'll change your perception of everything here. All right. So, um, I'm going to look at this. Okay. So what I have here is I have the shares fully diluted, uh, and Bitcoin numbers. These are coming directly from the eight Ks. Okay. What's an AK? An AK is a filing that the a public company needs to do that's in between regular filings, regular quarterly filings for um, a substantial material changes in their capital structure. So MicroStrategy is issuing new shares all the time. They're buying Bitcoin with it. That's material. So they have to issue these AKs. And since about June, they've been putting these AKs in a format that makes it very easy for us to decipher. So in this spreadsheet, which I've provided a link to, I'm gonna, I have a link to these, uh, to these things. Now let's take the most recent version of it, okay? Here's the most recent version of it. And you can see in this most recent version, I have a total Bitcoin holdings here, which is 423,750 coins. And we have an assumed diluted shares outstanding here, okay? Which is 275,642, right? So this includes all the convertibles and it includes, um, of course, all the Class A and Class B shares um, outstanding, okay? Uh, and they also calculate these Bitcoin yields quarter to date and yield to date. Now this quarter to date is really important but so is this year to date. Everybody's been fixated on this year to date number, which is about 68% now. That means that every share of MicroStrategy has 68% more Bitcoin in it than it did in January. But this is the most amazing number, 43%. And what I'm gonna show is even more amazing is that we're, we're running about 1% per day in terms of Bitcoin yield. Um, so how, let, let's get into that. Uh, let's go back to the spreadsheet and we can see if I look here, I look at the shares, I look at the Bitcoin, I can compute by dividing the Bitcoin into the shares and multiplying by 100,000. I get, uh, here's the formula, 100,000 times the shares divided by the Bitcoin. Um, that is, I'm sorry, 100,000 times the Bitcoin divided by the shares. That is the sats per share. Okay. And you can see that we're at 153,000 sats per share now. And that number has, I mean, has escalated really dramatically. Uh, obviously in the quarter, right? 
But even more remarkable, in the month, right, between 11.12 and 12.9, we've gone up 33% in SaaS per share. So if we can go up 33% in one month, we can easily double the amount of SaaS per share in one year, or, or maybe, maybe even triple it, okay, if we're on this kind of path. So what I'm trying to explain is this thing is an extraordinary, an extraordinary amount of uh, accretion to, to uh, and how, how are they doing this? Simply by issuing tons and tons and tons of shares. I mean, we, we basically went in and we added, you know, 423,000 minus 279,000. So let's call it 140,000 Bitcoin in, in the last month. Uh, you know, with Bitcoin nearing a hundred thousand, that's fourteen billion. Uh, I mean, this is these are really big numbers of of uh, really big numbers of uh, of change in the position, right? So, uh, you know, I'm going to go through a further analysis a little later, talking about exactly what happens with different at the uh, at the monies, what happens if they increase? They did more than the twenty-one billion that they were gonna that they have for the shelf registration. I'm gonna talk about warrants and all the stuff at a further date, but I want to keep this video kind of short, and so that's I'm just gonna leave it there. Um, as usual, if you like my content, please hit the subscribe button. It's absolutely free. If you want to subscribe to me on Twitter, that one I charge one dollar per month. Put in a little bit of extra content there, and I engage a little bit more with the people on my subscription feed. So, uh, hey, feed me a bone um, and subscribe to my Twitter as well for a buck a month. Um, I will see you guys online, and I will talk to you on Spaces. See ya. Bye.